this time I will try make a four axis two path with an X software. I was inspired by this video. This machine is make in a sliding plate board. You can see the spindle can swing in this um, Z, Y plate, so it can do this work fast and efficiently. So after watching this video, I have an idea to create a two path like that. Okay, so I made a video, I made a, a 3D model of the sliding plate and uh, you can see there are 8 holes on it for um, screw bolts. So first um, we go into the manufacturing mode and then um, in Geometry view, we design uh, define the workpiece. The part is just uh, the one we made, and also the block is also the one we made. And press OK. Then we create two, uh, make a two of uh, uh, mail, and uh, name it. Uh, 12.7 and OK. And uh, here's diameter. We make it this and uh, lens. We make it 30 and the flute lens make it about uh, um, 18, I think, is OK. And for the holder, I can just uh, uh, retrieve a holder from library and uh, this one seems just okay. Okay, and then we can. Um, create operation. I choose this contour profile so it will the, use the tool to uh, work on the floor and on the walls and uh, choose the tool I just made and uh, choose a method of finish and uh, press OK and uh, I need to define the floor here. The three parts use as the floor because I want the tool to uh, pass through the bottom line. So, okay, and uh, uncheck this and uh, I select the wall press end to back to the ISO view OK and uh, here's the method and the tool use the one way make it and the two axes I make it Align to edges and uh, 
here define the speed I just make uh, make it uh, sorry here cannot use that make it um, 18,000 press enter and press this and so it will generate these values automatically and then press OK and uh, cutting parameter we can change the climb or the uh, conventional conventional cuts here and uh, you can choose multi pulses here if necessary okay and uh, here we make it this step is not so necessary and uh, last we can generate the two path uh oh sorry seems okay we can do a simulation okay okay so here we got this two path and in we can simulate machine here and uh, can pass the speed here and we can change the view here you can see the how this the spindle moves can make it move again okay so this is the profiling two path and uh, the drilling drilling is a normal three axis two path I can just uh, find features um, parameter recognition workpiece and then in here I can select the step holes and then Fun features. Okay, you can see the eight holes was being found automatically. I press OK. For this, I create feature process, make it mill wheeling, mill and drill, and OK. Okay, so in the operation navigator, I can see several tragedy um, strategy here, and uh, I want to use the drill in center. So I just double click to edit. I want to use the same tool, so I expand this, choose the same tool, and uh, just keep all of that by default I do generate okay and uh, simulation make lower speed run so you can see the 
uh, simulation. I can change the speed here. Okay. So the last is to post res and uh, choose the four axis. I think is okay. Or this one. I think the top one is just okay. And uh, um, find the folder and output the two paths. And then you can use the two paths on your four axis machine. Okay, um, I think this is um, not a tutorial because I am just a beginner in this software and there are a lot of things that I can understand very well. Uh, I just uh, accidentally found this method how to make a 4-axis 2 paths and I haven't um, take it to practice yet. So if you happen to have an uh, have a four axis machine um, in your workshop, you can try this and tell me the results. Thank you for watching. I'm Liu Xing.